kind of went through a similar thing years and years ago where when I would attempt to meditate and go deeper inward, I would encounter like waves of resistance and and feel the strong temptation to, to distract away from the stillness and notice that there was a strong resistance there. And it was also the time when the Course was in my life and I was just like saying, well, I, I really have some strong resistance here with the silence and to meditation and, and it was like the Holy Spirit saying, yeah, we, we know that, uh, we, we're going to work with you on developing your miracle working capabilities and I was living in a hermitage uh, in the woods actually at the time. And then people started to show up little by little and then I was guided to go out and go to a course group in Lexington, Kentucky and then to others. And, and little by little it started my journey of, of just giving over everything to the Holy Spirit and saying, use me in a way, in a helpful way because I knew and I was told that that would help uh, wash away the resistance. And I didn't know it was like going to be like many year process of sharing and extending and connecting and practice trusting that, you know, I'm here to be truly helpful or use me, speak through me, shine through me, share through me. So, you know, it's very much like the contrast between like a, like a Ramana Maharshi uh, um, self-inquiry method, which is who is the I kind of thing versus a meditation method. This is more tuning into the Spirit and really flowing with what's given and guided, knowing that that will help clear away the resistance, even though that seems to involve act activity. You know, that you're actually actively speaking and sharing and meeting people and going places and so forth. And so, I think that that can be the thing. It's, it's opening you to the purpose of letting the Spirit use you and that's a very different purpose for meeting people than in the past. In the past, you know, the ego would have you meet people to get something from them. Whether it's spiritually or physically, psychologically, economically, there, it was always guiding us to meet people to get. And of course there was a lot of, of friction and conflict and difficulty with that old purpose. Now you're wanting the people to come and be brought to you as part of uh, you healing, seeing them in a healing way, wanting to give and extend, have something to offer to them, instead of something to get from them. And slowly, when you keep coming up with that, like that's the prayer of your heart, to join together and to bring something, to bring a gift, to bring a blessing, slowly that washes away the, the fear and the resistance, in a beautiful way. And you just have to be real patient with it, you know, the, it can be like, I want it now, I want it now, I want immediate results. <laughs>